Ladies and gentlemen, this is Keith from iRepair Autos. Today I'm going to be showing you how to look at your trip computer data information, fuel consumption, average speed, miles until you're empty, how many hours you've driven before and after your last reset, and all that other goodness that's all displayed in your cluster. You can see this information while you're driving. It's good to know how many miles per gallon you're averaging, um, average speed, in case you have you know, teenagers that's driving the car, or if you're just curious to see what the average speed is in the vehicle, stay with me and I'm gonna show you how to get all that information. So ladies and gentlemen, what we're gonna do is, we're gonna touch this page up button right here. And we're gonna touch that page button until we see repeatedly until we see the user uh, function for the trip computer. So let's press that page up, press it again, press it again, press it, and then press it. And then if you look closely, it will say after start, you've driven 93 miles since we last started the car, three hours and 42 minutes. The average speed was 25 miles per hour and your Fuel consumption was right around 19.3 miles per gallon. Now, zooming back out, going to the up arrow right here, we're gonna press the up arrow and it's gonna show you after reset, how many miles you've gone. 38,513 miles since we last reset the car. And that's by pushing that R button up here. We've driven the vehicle 1,535 hours and 28 minutes. Throughout that whole duration, it's 25 mile per hour average speed, so a lot of local driving. And the average consumption consumption for your fuel economy was 18.6 miles per gallon. Pushing the up arrow again, if you were driving, you would have your range. It would show you how many miles before you would have an empty tank. Since the car is off, the engine isn't running, and we're not driving, it's zeroed out right now. And that puts you right back to after start. As always, everyone, don't forget to like, share, subscribe to my channel if you find these videos helpful. What that does, it pushes my videos up in the search results so that other Mercedes Owners, drivers, do-it-yourselfers can find them easier. Thanks and peace out.